I stepped into Walmart about a week ago to see if they had any seeds and uh, I saw they had a huge display, really huge, of um, all these different types of bulbs and roots and stuff like that, which I do not recall from years past. So uh, either they've stepped up their game or I'm paying more attention, not sure. <laughs> but I was very pleased to see these and uh, they were $3 each, which is a bargain, and I'm looking forward to giving them a try. I got some strawberries here, 10 of these little roots for $3, they're June bearing. Uh, last time I bought strawberries, I got the type that bear fruit all season. And uh, after reading and doing a little bit of research, I realized that the ones that bear all season, they do actually bear all season, but very small amounts of fruit. And the ones that bear just once a year, you get a nice amount of strawberries all at once. So that was certainly my experience. So I'm going to try these and uh, see what happens. I also picked up some onions. There's 100 bulbs there. Uh, I've had quite a bit of luck with um, garlic. I bought some garlic, uh, uh, I guess one of they're called garlic heads or whatever, at uh, a nursery in the fall. And I've been planting those over the season, over the winter, and they're starting to come up really nicely. So I may do this. I'm not sure what the planting season is for onions, but... I'll be putting them in as long as it's practical, kind of in increments, and we'll see what happens. There's a hundred of them in here, different types, which is very convenient, and uh, kind of a little tiny size there, and I'm looking forward to putting them in the containers. And finally, uh, asparagus. Five of them for $3. I tried, um, I tried asparagus last year. I got some plants from the uh, nursery, and I planted them in the ground in an area I thought was good, but they've totally disappeared. So I'm going to be doing these, I think, in um, in containers like a lot of the rest of my uh, things I'm growing, mainly because the soil here is so bad. And also I can move them around if, uh, if where I put them isn't any good. You actually cannot eat asparagus uh, for the first year or two. So these will just be on standby, uh, I guess, until 2022 or 2023. But judging from how these look in the picture, should be well worth it. As I mentioned, um, they had a huge display of, of all sorts of stuff, flowers and all sorts of stuff there in the garden center. So I will probably be going back and maybe getting some flowers too, but first I have to assess what's going on in the garden at large and uh, if that's practical. If not, I'm excited about starting these, uh, these three elements and uh, I'll see how it goes and I'll keep you posted.